Just on. Flounder. I got flounder. Target species. Welcome to Mental Health Day. It is our last day on vacation, unfortunately. We've been here for a week. We've gone crabbing, we've gone fishing, we've gone fly fishing, we've caught some fish, caught some crabs. But there's one thing we haven't done. Go out there and drown some minnows. So that's what we're gonna do today. We actually been catching our own bait all week. Got a minnow trap here. Anything in there? Pull it up, all the way up, all the way up, all the way up. We ain't getting no minnows. Oh no! That's okay, we've been collecting minnows all week, so we should have enough to go out here to see if there's any fish. We're hoping there's some flounder. We're gonna look for some, some deep ledges and some drop-offs, and there's an outgoing tide right now, so the tide's moving, the bait's moving, the fish are moving. Hopefully, we'll catch something. But here's our bait. Yep, and there's one big fishy that is mine, so I'll have to use my bait. You got some baby spot in there, too. And then my big fish is... Yeah, you caught that fish this morning. I don't think we're going to use a white perch for bait. We should probably let them go. What do you think? No. Oh, you're going to put them on the live line? Yeah. Okay, let's do that. See what happens. All right, throwing Mr. White Perch out on the live line. Hopefully somebody's paying attention to this while we're going. Yeah. We're going to double up in the kayaks and see you out in the river. There goes Max and Gabe. There's Kurt and Grace. Go. We're trying to catch some flounders. Woohoo! Big fishies. Alrighty guys, <laughs> good luck, we love you, bye, love you. Love you. Alright Grace, we got a bull minnow on the bottom and a silver side on the top and all we're going to do is flip it in the water, let it hit the bottom, flip your bail and wait for something to bite it, okay? Okay. We just got rammed, you ram us? No. Oh, the, the waves rammed us? Okay, buddy. I'll remember that. Here, you ready? Here's a big one. Oh, boy. Definitely don't want to waste any. The light thump, thump, thump. That's just it bouncing off the bottom. You'll, you'll know when you have a real bite, okay? Gabe's on? Get him, Gabe. Oh, that does look like a big one. Get him, Gabe. What's he got? A croaker? Croaker. Good job, Gabe. You caught another croaker. We haven't caught nothing but a sunburn. Good job, buddy. Yes, honey. We caught a big stingray on the live line. Nice. Well, are we going to eat it? Dude, they caught a big old stingray on your live line. Really? Yeah. Oh, Grace is on. Love you, bye. You, you got a croaker. You swing it over here to daddy. That's good. Gracie caught a croaker. The kids are out fishing us, Max. Good job, Gracie. And uh, my wife just called me. Her and Megan just landed a huge stingray on the white perch live line that Max threw out before we left. So we're probably gonna cut off the wings to that and have some pulled skate wing for dinner. Yay, I caught a stingray. <laughs> you didn't catch nothing. <laughs> oh man, what a beautiful day. Right here seems to be the best spot because this is where this river and that river are pulling out with the tide. And it should be deep right here. Daddy! Oh, you got a big spot. We were talking to the gentleman on the uh, Carolina skiff. Oh, not too much in my face. We put on some, some fish bites for Grace. I got one on one of my hooks too. Oh, there it goes. Easy release. These little uh, bag of worms. It's supposed to be like blood worms alternative. They work pretty well for small bait fish. They stay on the hook pretty good too. You said all the flounder are small. Oh, oh, there's a fish. Big spot, they hit so freaking hard. Yay, I got the skunk out. I got him on the uh, fish bites. You go in the hatch. See you, buddy. It's like a live well, but not. What do you got? What do you got on there? You got a double. Grace's got a double. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Whoa. That's a big old spot. Dave, Go in I there. I got two fish. See ya. See ya, buddy. We should be keeping those and freezing them and bringing them for cut bait when we're surf fishing, but 
We're just fishing for fun unless we catch something we can eat tonight. We already got a stingray, so we'll probably do a catch and cook on that thing later. Oh. What do you got going on here? We're on top of the spot hole? Yep. Here, keep it in the water, Grace. I got to rebait my line. Caught him right in the nose. Get out of here. <laughs> I got Good water. job, Grace. Yeah. Oh, no, I wasn't recording. <sighs> well, I just caught a flounder, and I wasn't recording. I don't know when I stopped it, but I didn't restart it. Hopefully, we'll catch another one. It wasn't a keeper. It was probably like 13 inches, but it was a target species. Oh, Uncle Max is on. Uncle Max has a spot. Second spot. Woo! Oh, Grace is on. Whoa, what do you got? Big spot. <laughs> Can't get the flounder on video, but I can get the spot on video. Ah! Easy release. Bye. You on, Gabe? Yeah, a little spot. Baby spot. Do, 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 do. Baby spot. Oh, 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 yeah. I have something. Another spot. Seven. Seven or eight. I forget. They're a big spot, man. Good job, Grace. Oh. Oh. You need a net? Keep, uh, keep your rod tip up. I can't. Keep it up. That's a big. That's a big fish. It might be a big flounder, Grace. Oh, you got a doubler again. <laughs> nice. It's okay. That's why we're wearing bathing suits. Yeah. So we can get wet. Oh. <laughs> Chaos. Daddy, we have a fish in the boat. We'll get them. See you, buddy. There's a ton of spot right here. That was fun. I thought you had a big flounder on there. Spot. Oh, he ate the minnow. That minnow was for a flounder, buddy. That wasn't for you. See ya. It's on. Flounder. I got flounder. Target species. There's a flounder right there, buddy. It's got a white belly and a dark top. Sits right on the bottom and blends in. It's probably about the size of the first one I caught, maybe a little bit bigger. They need to be 16 and a half to keep, and he definitely isn't that big. You see him, Grace? Yeah. Watch him swim away. Thanks for the fight, little buddy. Get bigger. Oh, you got me all wet, little sucker. We got a target species, Grace. High five. Yeah. 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 Oh. You got something big, Grace? I keep your rod tip up. Keep your rod tip up. Oh, you did. Oh, you, you just hooked him in the head weird. Yeah, you caught him in the eyeball. Oh. Sorry, buddy. Oh, that felt good. That was a bigger flounder. I thought, I thought I had a bigger that was a bigger flounder. You know how they take it weird? Oh, yeah. They don't always put the whole minnow in their mouth. I just premature elation. I'm doing, I'm cast that was a better fish. Oh. Uncle Max has caught a little flounder. Mine was bigger. Nanny, nanny, nanny. What a freaking beautiful day. Uncle Max is hooked up. Another spot. <laughs> Grace keeps putting fish in my face. <laughs> Spotcha. <laughs> Caught him right in the nose. Oh. Hey, what are you doing on here? Hey, buddy. Oh, Uncle Max has got something. Had something. All right, Grace, give him the loser. Loser. <laughs> Grace and I are going in to eat a little lunch and to see this stingray. So as soon as we get back there, we'll check it out. All right, so what's going on over here? Gabe, you gonna lift the top? You gonna lift the top and show them what I got? Here you go, you can pull this. Ready? Yeah. Pull it off. Whoa! Whoa what's that tail? Yeah, that, that, tail? that is a stingray. That's an actual stingray. <laughs> it fills up a whole bushel basket. There's a stinger a right there. Oh yeah. Did you guys beat him up? No. Nope. Beast mode, the ladies caught the biggest fish of the trip. <laughs> Wife's a beast. Well, I just cut up that stingray. We're gonna do a catch and cook on that. We're gonna have that for dinner as our last meal. I'm gonna go drift the shoreline over there, throw this little gulp shrimp, see what I can catch. But we're done bait fishing for the day. Uh, hopefully I can get on a nice redfish or a striper or something. There he is, first cast. What is it? I just tried jumping. 
Is it a trout? It is a trout. I haven't seen one of them yet this trip. It's a speck. Uh, there you go, Bobby. My good buddy Bobby has never caught a speckled sea trout. So it's something he's always wanted to do. I literally just got out to the spot. That's a fat speckled sea trout. Look at that. You got some teeth. Use my lip grippers. And there we go. Put her on a stick. She's rated 15 inches, so it is a legal fish. But look at that belly. She's pregnant. I'm not keeping that fish. I'm letting her go. These are delicious to eat, but I'd rather see more in here next year if we come again. See you later. <laughs> That's a new species for the trip too. We have not caught a speck. We've caught just about every saltwater species you can think of. Speckled, speckled sea trout, except the speckled sea trout. All right, well, that was the first cast. Let's see if we can get some more. It's a fish. It's another trout. Nice. No, it's a little red. <laughs> hey, what are you doing, little buddy? I'm going to let you go, buddy. Beautiful little redfish. Little guy. There's keepers in here the whole first part of the week. Now they're just little guys. See you, buddy. Appreciate it. I'm literally right in front of our dock. I'm working my way back in. I told the wife, I was only going to go out for an hour because I've uh, got to finish cooking and then we're going to have a fire pit with the kids to end out the, the amazing week that we've had. So I'd like to say thank you to you guys for watching and hanging out for the week. Uh, it was awesome doing some saltwater fishing. And uh, till next time, God bless. I'm probably not done fishing, but I'm definitely done fishing from the kayak for the weekend because I got to clean this pig up. Oh man, I'm going to miss you. The place is beautiful.